he's got supporters. Detroit, New York, Los Angeles, inciting large-scale arrests and sympathy marches. I'm very aware of that, Mr. Hoover. What I do know is he's nonviolent. What I need to know right now, what's Martin Luther King about to do next? The historical biodrama Selma, directed by Ava DuVernay, recently premiered at the Ziegfeld Theatre in New York City. The movie shows the 1965 Selma to Montgomery voting rights marches led by Martin Luther King Jr. All the cast members expressed their pride about being part of such an important film. The last time I was here was working as a publicist, and so to step onto this for a movie that I'm a part of as a director, I can't even tell you. If I talk about it too much, I'll get emotional. Really, really beautiful night. I haven't been a part of anything like this. I haven't been to a premiere with a movie that, that means this much. So this is a different, and the connection and the bond that was formed between Ava and the cast and crew and the producers, it's a, it's a different type of feeling. So this, this is like a joy that I have never felt and an inspiration I've never felt. The relevance and the presence of this movie becomes even more clear to all of us as we stand here. And so it's a celebration, but it's also just a really proud moment that we've made something that has social relevance and that feels um, important. Mr. President, in the South, there have been thousands of racially motivated murders. We need your help. Dr. King, this thing's just going to have to wait. It cannot wait. You've got one big issue, i got a hundred and one. Summer it is. Here is the next great battle. Sam was the place, and they read it. Dr. King! I tell you, that white boy can hit. This movie teaches in so many ways that the only way to affect change is not just with African American, but with everyone standing together as one to have us move in a direction of change. I think it's important because peaceful protest is something, a tool that we've been using for a long time. It's an effective tool. Uh, and it's just good to be reminded that you know, only 50 years ago, Martin Luther King and his comrades changed the world by peacefully protesting. We can't forget that violence is not the way, but uh, a group of people that uh, join their voices together can be the most powerful tool to make a statement and to, to get things done. And I think this movie is, is a good example of that. It is unacceptable that they use their power to keep us voiceless. Those that have gone before us say no more. The people. The people. The people. The people. The people. We must make a massive demonstration. White, black, and otherwise. Come to Selma. Looks like an army out there.